for tuning in to Running in Heels on WindsorStar.com. I am in my new best friend's house. <laughs> this is Deb Thompson of Figgy Shoes. I'm surrounded with shoes. As you can see all these shoe boxes. Deb is an artist and a photographer, and what she does is so special. Check this out. This is, this would have been a plain white shoe, and Deb has designed with paint, so it's like a tattoo for a yeah, shoe. Yeah, pretty much. Personal elements um, belonging to a couple who's getting married. This is a, a May 26th wedding, and um, this one doesn't have names, but you on have... This, actually, on this one it is. Oh, so when you put them, shoe. When you put them together, you have their names and your date. So a personalized shoe. And then shoe. heels, I do. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, the romantic in me is coming out. <laughs> How did you come up with this idea? Um, it was pretty much just a favor for a friend. Um, I had a phone call from a girl who's another photographer in Windsor, and she, like, two weeks before her wedding, she was like, okay, so can you do me a huge favor? She's like, I know it's busy season for weddings and whatever, but, you know, could you paint a pair of shoes for my wedding? Mm -hmm. So I was like, well, I've never done that before. Like, I have no idea if I could do it, but why not? It'd be fun. Right. So that's kind of how And how long started. ago was that? Uh, May 2010. So. so it's been two years, and how many yeah. shoes do you think you've done over that time? Uh, well, I keep track. Like, I sign the bottom so that they're all, like, numbered. Oh, okay. And I've now done 178 pairs. That's fantastic. So, yeah. And you get orders, I guess, from all over yes, the Yes, all over country. the world, actually. All over the yeah. world. Yeah. That's, and it's not even just bridal shoes. She does... Um, just These were, you were saying, like, bridesmaids? Yeah, bridesmaids, or even I've done some pairs for anniversaries or birthdays or just special occasions, or even just, you know, fa people's favorite things if they want to have personalized shoes, so. And baby shoes. And baby shoes. <laughs> These are great, because you know there was that trend where people were bronzing their baby shoes. You have to do that. You yeah, can... yeah. This one's for an Well, and these are, these are fun, too, because the whole theme behind these shoes are his bedding. So they sent me photos okay. of, like, their nursery set or whatever. So, like, the little stripes are from the little ruffle from the crib or whatever. And the little quote is from part of their whatever on the bedspread. And, like, the rocket ships are from the bedspread and everything. So it's all, like, it's still personalized. That's very you know, cute. baby stuff. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that it says, we love you to the moon and back. So it's yeah, very, so very sweet. You also do purses. Yes. Yeah, pretty much any accessories. Like, there are some things that might not work because of fabric types, but, mm -hmm. um, like, these especially, the leather finish is easy to paint, so. Yeah, Other than leather finish, what's the best type of fabric to work with? Especially um, when it comes to shoes, because they come in... Yeah, they come in every kind of finish, pretty much. Uh, textures. Um, pretty much any any shoe can be painted. Um, I've done suede, tons of satin, because a lot of bridal shoes are satin. Um, these are satin as well. But, um, like, these shoes I'm wearing are patent leather, although these are a little bit more limited. Better. Let's take that shoe off. <laughs> Send her off. Yeah, exactly. So, um, those are a little bit more limited just because the colors that I can use on patent leather are not as widely ranged as what I can use on other okay. fabrics. But my favorite is, like, a, a matte leather finish like this. Mm -hmm. So it's not the shiny kind. Um, and then probably second is satin. So, okay. But yeah. you can work with anything. Pretty much. Should yeah. be a plain shoe though, right? Uh, preferably. Like I have done some that have a lot of, um, like whether it's little brooches or like even on these, for example, there's the brooch at the toe. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, the, like the more area there is to paint, the more you're going to get out of it. So like I've had some people send me sandals and whatever and I can do it. It's just not as personalized, I guess, because there's just not, not as, as much room. space. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So typically, how long does it take you to get one pair of shoes? Right? Um, depends on the shoe, but at, on average, about six to ten hours. That's, so. that's amazing. And yeah. you do it all in the studio? Yes. And all do you home. ship out? Do the people yes. come and pick them up? Um, people who are local can come pick them up. Actually, a girl just came and picked hers up like five minutes before you got here. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, most of the shoes that we do are shipped all over the world. So pair of your shoes personalized, I'd urge you to visit www.figgyshoes.com. Give Deb a call or visit uh, windsorstar.com, running in heels, and I'll have all the information posted for you. Till next time.